Hey, don't push on the door, babe. I'm trying, don't push on the door. You cannot do that. You gonna sit it? You gonna sit in the car? So, I sit in it. Shane, come here, I'll show you what. Yeah, you can sit in. I'll take it in. So, the problem is, is the steering wheel is right on my legs. You would shoot your pants if this car cranked up. Who you gapping today? Who you gapping? Him. Him? Josh, she said she gonna gap you. You got it, kid. This <laughs> is her car. <laughs> hey, we do need to measure this and order those parts, though. Yeah, because I just want to be able to make my turn, yeah. do what I want to do with it. And so that way I'm not stressed. If we if we trim these back, right, then I'll have to cut that one too, I suppose, and we'll tip it up. We have, see if we can get like a five inch adapter maybe to so that. And that'll put the wheel still in the same spot, you know, same way. But it'll. When I pull the wheel off, it goes over here and I got all this to get out. Because that's the only get out part is like if I had to get out in a hurry, this is going to be that's in my way. Right. So if the end of the spline was like right there, that would be perfect. And the thing is, once we cut these, once you break these loose, like right here, and these are free, you can break this one loose. And then this thing will move up to where we want it to be, tack that back in place, figure out what we want to do. And these can always be just pushed back down and welded to the sides or whatever. Yeah, we could probably flex these without it even oh, busting absolutely. the paint. Oh, absolutely. Without yes. even just heat it up with a heat gun and bend them down. I wouldn't even think yeah. you'd have to heat it. Maybe not. Because what you do is by the time we lift this one up and tack that one down there, these will touch where they need to touch. Yeah, It'll works. probably be like right here and they'll start touching right there. That's how I did Frosty. Probably cut it and then cut back like I think if we take a grinder and we cut that bitch here and cut that bitch here, these will kind of pop out a little bit. We'll be able to move a little bit. You can cut this one as close as you can through here. Cut it this way. You know what I mean? Yeah. But when you cut, put blankets all in this bitch. Oh, no doubt. 
And then before we cut, grind, weld, or anything, we need to undo everything on that fucking computer and get the battery out of it. That way there's no way possible to do whatever, but whenever y'all go to cutting and grinding and shit, like, cover this entire bitch. If you gotta have Freddy come in and take it off, paint it off, whatever, like, whatever we gotta do to cut it, take both doors off. Remember too, I wanna put a fucking kill switch up here because I don't like this. You gonna keep it the same color, Josh? Mm -hmm. You gonna keep it the same color? Yeah. yeah. Shit, it's like a fucking $30,000 paint job. On the inside, just the chassis and shit. This might have been a lot. Uh, yeah. About a two-year build. About a two-year build. It's going to be so, like, in, uh, uneventful. You're going to be like... This is going to be like a slot car. Just a really fucking fast one. I don't think that's how that works. Uh, I, do. I know dragsters, yes. These cars, I don't think I don't think they're gonna be that uneventful to be honest with y'all. As long as it stays stuck, it knocks the tires off of it. Shit's gonna get real fast. Oh, I don't think it'll knock the tires off of it much. I think they'll shake. You'll have a bunch of tire shake. Yeah. Hunter's car has one of those little extensions on it. Cause it doesn't have to be like crazy. But if we took these and by the time we lifted it and they touched about right here and that extension was, you know, day long or whatever, we just really need to cut it and fucking see where it all mounts at and then order the extension. That's what I think. But we gotta pull this. I don't even know what they mean. So we'll just make it simple. Just as long as Everybody's on the same page that this is a quarter million dollar car, and if y'all catch Bobby and sitting in it making race car noises, fire him. I thought nobody could use a lot of cars. Nobody in here is allowed to touch the car. Don't put that dog in that car. Honey Grace. Where'd the steering wheel go? No, I can't drive. There's no holder. <laughs> Can you imagine when she gets older, this being her car? What do you think? That seat fitted. They formed it just for me. It fits me. Does it? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Perfecto. Feels better, huh? You would shit your pants if this car cranked up right now. Who you gapping today? Yeah, Who you gapping? Him. Him? Josh, she said she gonna gap you. You got it, kid. <laughs> it's her car. <laughs> hey, we do need to measure this in one of those parts, though. That extension thing for the steering wheel. That was on its way.